everyone and welcome back to another video so this is an exciting one i've got a big haul from madame glam i know this box isn't that big but when you consider how big the madame glam boxes are usually with a full gel polish collection in this is bigger than that um so yeah as you can probably see from the title i've got the builder gels in pots and i've been waiting for these for so long i wanted to order them um but then they went out of stock when they just had the pink the white and the clear um, but then because I waited they actually brought out more colours so I was able to order them all at the same time um, so I am a VIP member with Madame Glam so if you want to become a VIP member you can see information about that on the website basically you pay $29 a month and that accrues in your Madame Glam account and then you can use that and get 50% off your gels all the time and if you live in the US or Canada you get free shipping as well so let's just get into this box shall we so i did get some brushes as well so I'm, i did need to replace two of my brushes and one of them is a new one so i'll just have a look at those first i'm not going to take them out of the packaging because you've seen me use them before so this is the detail liner which is the smaller liner brush and then we've got the this is a petal brush, so this is new. I've not had one of those before. And this one is the ultra liner, so this is a little bit longer than the detail liner. So they're just normal liner brushes. So let's look at this one. So this is a petal brush. And when you get a new brush, you do need to just do this with it and just get any of the um, the glue because they put glue on them to keep the bristles all together when they're in packaging to protect them so the petal brush just looks like that and you can paint you know it's just easier to paint petals with it you see that so yeah let's get on with these gels so as you can see um, this set here is the original set that they brought out so there's a clear a pink and a milky white so we're going to swatch those first and then we're going to move on to these so these are the new ones so you've got a rose pink a light lavender a light purple and then a shimmer pink a shimmer nude and a shimmer white now i already have a lot of the builder gels but the builder in a bottle so i'm going to do some comparisons at the end of the video and show you what they look like against those because while I do love Madame Glam's Builder Gels in a bottle, it's a lot easier, in my opinion, to use gels when you're building nails to use them from pots with an applicator brush. So, right, so let's get them out. So even though the pots do actually look quite big, you don't get this amount. And this is the same for a lot of companies that sell gel in pots like this. Um, they are domed on the inside so you know there is a lot of space inside this pot that isn't taken up by gel so they are 15 grams so that's how much will be in there so as usual with Madame Glam they are vegan you can see that on there they are cruelty free so they've not been tested on animals at all they are palm oil free 21 free formula so that's 21 of those nasty ingredients that you will get in really cheap gels um they've all been taken out so you won't you know sort of i'm not saying you won't have a reaction but you're going to have less chance of having a reaction without those nasty chemicals in um, they are also hema free which is obviously something that a lot of people are allergic to including myself um, but there are actually three types of hema so you might see hema free on packaging it doesn't mean that it's free from all three types of HEMA. So I do need to point that out. I learned this recently. So if something says HEMA free, you might actually still react to it. Luckily, I'm okay with gels. I don't seem to react to them. Um, but something like Monomer that's got HEMA in, that must be a different type. I am highly allergic to that. So yeah, just be very careful. So the ingredients are there if you want to just screenshot that and have a look. So they're all the same size, they're all 15 gram. I'm not going to swatch the clear one because it's just a clear. 
So that one aside, I'm going to swatch all of these. So I'm going to get the swatch sticks out and I will be back in a minute. So I'm just going to open one up and show you what it looks like inside because they do have a foil layer. So I did just want to show you that, that they are all fully sealed, but they do have a little tab here that you can pull off. So this is the pink, like original one. And that's what that one looks like. Don't want to tip it too much because they are quite fluid. So this is my Madame Glam applicator brush, application brush. And this is what it looks like. So I am going to put the gel on the underside of the swatch stick. So I'm going to start off with just a very, very thin layer, sort of as a slip layer. And I do like the consistency of it. So this looks to me, I'll have to compare it, but this looks to me very sim similar to the light pink Builder Gel in a bottle. So I'm just going to put some music on now while I swatch the rest of them and then I'll come back and speak to you when we've got them all together and we can do some comparisons.
Okay, so all the swatches are done now and this is how they look. What do you think? Oh, I'm so impressed with these. I absolutely love them. So yeah, they are beautiful colours. I really wasn't sure at first when I started opening the pots. Some of them look very, very sort of brightly coloured. But I think that's just because the inside of the pot is white. So it does make that colour pop a lot more than it normally would. And obviously if it's going to be on your natural nails then it's going to look a bit darker that's why i always use clear swatch sticks as well if you use the sort of natural tips they are lighter and they're going to brighten any color so it doesn't really give um i don't think anyway a proper indication of what the color is so yeah i absolutely love those and what i'm going to do now um, I'm going to get my swatch sticks out for the Builder in a Bottle gels and see if we can compare them and see how they look together um, and what the difference is. So I will be back in a minute. Okay, so I've got them now. So these are the Builder in a Bottle swatches that I've got. These are very old. So yeah, they're quite lumpy bumpy um, and they are on these little ones. So start off with the white. Obviously we've got two whites. We've got the milky white and the shimmer white so let's put it next to the milky white almost identical really isn't it um yeah so not much difference there at all yeah i think the shimmer white is more sheer than the milky white is so next we're going to do the pinks so on the left is light pink and on the right is baby pink So this is the pink, the one that just says pink on the tub. And that is, it's not the same as either of them. It's sort of halfway in between. So it's definitely creamier and more opaque than that light pink. But it's not as coloured as the baby pink. So let's move on now to rose pink and light purple i'm going to keep in because that's almost a pink right okay so the shimmer pink is very similar to the baby pink but the shimmer pink is a little bit lighter in color i think the lavender one is is that lavender oh no the light purple is more purple and then the rose pink also has a different tone to it so that's more more of a more of a purple tone i think so they do i've got a blue one here obviously there's no blue um i have got this one which is called lavender they have actually got another builder in a bottle another purple one and i can't remember what it's called but I picked this lavender one, so we're going to keep light lavender and purple. So I think, again, they are so very, very similar. It's a little bit lighter, the lavender gel pot, than the Builder in a Bottle one is. So, yeah, there are the comparisons. It doesn't really compare to this um, light purple, which is nice. So then we've got a completely different one. So I'm not going to do any more with these today because I just wanted to show you the colours and give them all a swatch. But I will be doing something with these, whether it's on the practice hand or me, I'm not sure because my nails do need doing, they are growing out. So I have got a few ideas. So obviously we've got all these colours and then we've got the clear as well so we could encapsulate glitter and things like that. So yeah, if you want to get a discount on these, I think on the Madame Glam website at the moment, they are still 55% off all these gels at the moment. So you want to get that discount and you're not a VIP, you can still do that. And if it has finished, you can always get 35% off by using my discount code, which is on the screen. I'll also put it in the comments and my description box. So I'll also put links to all of these gels in the description box for you. So as usual, if you did like this video, please give it a like. And if you're not already a subscriber, why not subscribe? I'd love to have you here on my channel and then you'll get notified whenever I upload a new video if you click on the notification bell. So that is going to be it for this video. So thank you so much for watching and I will see you next time. Bye.